Welcome back to Let's Play X to the Threat. Anyway, let us continue, shall we? Just gonna try and make our way to uh, Seaswell, uh, the ba -ba 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 shipyard there, because the idea is that we'll pick up a Talari Vulture and then outfit it to be a mining vessel. So yeah, let us get moving, shall we? <sighs> I believe I went right up on this one, didn't I? Yeah, we read in this one. So we'll just make our way uh, northward as much as we can go, and then one east, and then one south, and I believe we should be there. I can't remember exactly though. We'll have to wait and see. Oh hey. Pirate or pirate Mandalay. We may be able to take the Mandalay, but we're not taking the Orinoco. Come on, catch up. Target is now. Your actions defy <sighs> our peaceful nature. If you do not stop firing, the kingdom of Baron regrets that it will be forced to take severe action. I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean I. I was trying to just defend. Target is now in firing range. Come on. In oh. the name of Queen Atreus and the Kingdom of Boron, we oh. thank you for your valuable assistance. That's fine. I completely meant that. Ah, oh, bollocks. Ah, unfortunately that might have damaged Entering something. System. Rock's fate. Both weapons are still firing, we've got all our shields. And everything else. Excellent. Right. We'll continue north then. That was completely my fault. And I shouldn't... I should have been more careful. Anyway. Ah, uh, this system's... Ah, uh, Rogue's Legacy. Or Rogue's Fate, even. This system, uh, supplies most of the lasers used by the Boron military. The sporadic fighting against the split and the defense of their systems from pirates and Xenon raiders... Ah, uh, Xenon raiders. Sorry. I'm just used to hearing them going, Xenon. Xeon Raiders, as it is a main supply and outfitting depot for the Boron Space Fleet, it is a prime target for split attacks, should hostilities resume between the two species. <gasps> but in between the two, uh, Split and Boron, there is the Talari. So hey, who knows, maybe the Talari will be like, Boron no, you're not allowed to go for it. Space equipment docks are locations in the Boron Very territory for upgrading space vehicles. Those are nice things, though. Triplex scanner. Excellent. We would want that later. Okay, so now I know where to get triplex scanner. Which are super nice. Okay. I'll have a look at uh, Boron equipment docks later. When I get myself an M3, or even an M4, probably. Hmm. But yeah, basically, the lower the number of classification, the better the craft. Basically, Engine or larger, system, I should say. Menelaus's frontier. So an M3 is the smallest craft. No, an M5 is the smallest craft. An M4 is a light fighter slash interceptor. And an M3 are essentially heavy fighters. Also, another thing about it, Menelaus's Frontier. The Boron and Taladi trade uh, emancipate amicably in this peaceful sector. As with all Boron sectors, the economy is heavily reliant on the agriculture and import of raw materials. The beguiled organic shapes of the Boron spaceship technology as uh, training stations are a constant reminder of their aquatic origins. Blah 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 blah. Sorry about that, I'm just failing at reading there. Not massive surprising as I'm dyslexic. Uh, but anyway, let's make our way, shall we? Also, now I think about it, I never actually had a look at the Entering system, COs Mercury. Exoid. I mean, we were give, uh, when I was given the Mercury beforehand, it had absolutely nothing, and uh, this one has less than nothing. That hull is basically crippled. Wow, I did not remember it starting with 5% hull, honestly. Huh. Okay, how are you doing anyway? Hmm. 
Wait, that is a Behemoth, isn't it? Yeah, a Behemoth. I might fit that. Outfit that, honestly. Has it got anything? Only six fighter drones. That's... yeah. Okay, I guess. Ah, uh, anyway. What do you have on your trading dock? Kaladi space equipment docks Shielding? are basically nice. functional but not made for comfort. They are built solely to upgrade space vehicles. Um, ba ba dum ba dum. Okay, you got both mobile drilling system and the ore collector, which is both what we need. So, this may be one of the places we actually go to get the stuff. You know what? Uh, Talani's Space Equipment space Dock. Equipment docking we'll just make a quick dock there. Activated. Now, think about it, read about this place. Ah, uh, CS Buxoid. On the border between Talari and Boron Space, this system acts as a major commercial centre for trade between the Federa Foundation and the Prophet Guilds, as well as providing large amounts of raw materials uh, used throughout Split. Uh, though the Split rarely design... Uh, the... Dean to trade... Oh, right. Though the Split rarely deemed to trade with the Boron, both rage to see trade with Taladi, and much of those business between the fusing species occurs Success between closed doors and the Chairman sector. CEO, all of the great the profit of the all to the great profit, profit of the Taladi, of course. You on board. Yeah, stop shouting at me. Connection also, I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I'll be back in a minute. Ah, sneezing. Love it. <sighs> Doesn't feel like my nose is about to explode. Mind the yes, yes, mind the gap. Um. Anyway, let's see. 134,000 plus 134,000 plus plus 30 164,000 roughly so let's say 200,000 just to keep ourselves safe so we need 200 odd thousand Uh, nope, not that one. 200 odd thousand, I'm going to stick that at, just so I can keep that in my head. It's a bit easier than, like, 164,000. Just say 200,000. Now, you know what, just so we have a bit more wiggle room with money too. 175,000 is what I'll say. So we'll create 175,000 entering system lying around. profit share. Um Anyway, uh profit share. The factory and refinery workers of profit share are renowned for their hard work and partying even harder. The bliss places can be rough at the cycle's end on refinery payday when the dice are loaded and the stakes are high. Tempers get frayed. Ah, uh, fried even. The smoke sharks and uh, speakeasies of profit share are commonly frequented by more than uh, more colourful pirate crews. By the more colourful. You you know what I mean. Hmm. But alas. Hmm. I'm trying to have a think. How much do I think is going to be Entering for this ship? system. Seize well. I think it's going to be more than I would like it to have been, but less than it could have been. Oh, we can even use the ship here, pretty much. <gasps> I'm going to also need a mineral scanner. Oh, bum. Teladi shipyard. No, we need Alpha. a we need a showroom. Not a shipyard, a showroom. There we go. Teladi showroom. Alpha. Okay. Docking granted. Autopilot active. But we also need a mineral scanner, as I was saying. Successfully docked. It's kind of unfortunate. Connection to local trading network established. Oh boy. The vulture is the trading. <sighs> There's only one one The vulture oh, is the trading vessel commonly used by the Teladi and all. 
I guess we could just the go over this. The is the transporter ordered at shipyard. Mobile drilling system. Mobile drilling system installed. Uh, mineral scanner mineral would be nice. Scanner installed. Ore collector. Ore collector installed. Duplex scanner. Scan boost boost extension. extension installed. What else do we need? Uh, or like. I will extend the cargo bay later. First off, we'll this extend speed. Engine tuning oh, you know installed. What? We'll fully expand rudder our rudder as well. Installed. And then just as well. Your cargo hmm. bay will be extended by a certain amount of cargo units using subspace compression technology. We're at 900 this right now. This will so. be more expensive every time you use it because of the cargo bay extension installed. Okay, so now we got a thousand cargo bay, which is nice. Oh yeah, we got uh what wait what? We've got seventeen thousand? Sweet. Or seventeen hundred? That's actually really nice. Cargo bay extension installed. Huh. This is a basic laser that is used in many light weapons and smaller fighter craft. Anyway. I'll do it for us for now. Um, we'll get inside her. Quickly save it now. Think about it. Really? That didn't work. Oh, come on. Normally it does work. No? You're not going to work for me. Attention. Security. Connection there to local go. trading network established. Uh, we'll save it in the first slot. If you're wondering those who were test saves I was doing. I say test saves, I was actually just playing it myself. Uh, but, yes. Uh, <laughs> hello to the Talari Vulture, we say. Looks like a lot of other ships, honestly. It's not the best ship. By a long shot. But, alas, what can you do? Anyway, we'll uh, make our scan Asteroid. of these asteroids on the way down. Singularity engine time accelerator. Not I found installed. out what I forgot. Oh, Teladi space equipment dock. Docking granted. Good thing I decided Auto to keep some money. Activated. Jeez. Singularity engine time oh. accelerator not installed. Bum. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot a Singularity Engine Time Accelerator. Like, come on, space! Seriously? Remember everything but the one thing that stops you from taking forever to do everything. Fine, that's just... Fine, it's an great. An Unfortunately, I don't think we're close enough to detect anything right now. But anyway, I am actually going to uh, leave that there for now, and I'll see you in a bit when I have either cleared this place out or, you know, left some asteroids that I think I might put a mining base on later. But anyway, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, I thought I'd actually show you how you're meant to mine, or how mining works in general. I don't know why the frame rate also just drops quite hard when I start recording, but whatever. Doesn't matter. It's not as bad as, uh... Anything else? Anyway, what you're meant to do essentially Morning. is just oops, Car scan the closed. asteroid, find out it has a yield of 13 ore, which is not a spectacular asteroid. But anyway, uh, get reasonably close, and if I stay back here roughly, here roughly, hop into the turrets, uh, we can fire off this. Give it a second to stop. Oh, we're not in range, are we? Ah, oh, bollocks. Come on. How close do we need to get again? One point... Nope, less than one. Seriously, come on, this can't... It can't be this close, can it? 
Oh wow, yeah. Just fire that off. And eventually you'll actually crack the asteroid first off though. Let's stop moving. Turn it back around so the turret can see again easier. And we'll crack her. I believe? Come on, we should be cracking her. No there we go, right, jeez. Asteroid. I think there's still chunks or right now. Is the most <gasps> no! Oh, thank goodness. Right, cool. And then we just collect it when it says that it's an XL sized piece of ore. I believe it might just do it automatically now. Like, um, an X3 Albion Preludes, you had to wait Warning, until you made it really small. Open. Shields are down. But I think this is small enough for this game. Yeah, there we go. And then you just pick all this stuff up. It's pretty simple, really. And kind of dull, I'm assuming, to watch. Cargo bay so, yeah. now contains ore. It's essentially how many works. It's not the most entertaining thing to do, but it works Warning, and it gets you quite easy money. Open. Shields are down. Quite easy money that is. Not spectacularly easy. Cargo bay now contains ore. There is easier ways when you get better things later. Like you can Warning, um, just hunt pirates. Open. Shield. Cargo bay now contains ore. But anyway, yeah, this is essentially One what I'm going to be doing bay now contains for the next, ore. well, probably three or so hours. Warning, cargo bay open, <sighs> shields are down. But anyway, I will see you in a bit when I've got something a bit more interesting than this to do. Probably just buying a new ship, honestly. Cargo bay okay, welcome back. I was just floating around collecting asteroids and we got a message. So, let us answer it, shall we? Hey Julian, Eleanor should have told you that I need to talk to you. It's rather important, so please contact me on the Argon One. I guess you know how to find way back to Argon Prime. See you soon. Bye. I, I was busy. Don't care how important your mission is. Mine is more important because it's mine. Because it's my mission. M mission? Mission. I'm curious. Did I get told to go there? Oh yeah, I did. Oh well, how, how, um, inconvenient for you, mister. Anyway, I'll be back in a second. I'm going to probably sell this ore. Yeah, that's quite a lot of ore. Um, how much are you buying it for, people? This laser forge manuf- 133, okay. What about you? This space missile factory manuf- 136. And you? Foundry is You're not buying it for that much, right? So, silkworm missile factory. One thirty-six, I guess it is then. Docking grand. You did say one thirty-six, right? Activated. Yeah, you're one thirty-six. So we'll sell uh, the ore we've collected right now here and see how much money we've got. If we got a reasonable amount of money, I'm probably going to buy myself. And Buster, maybe a Nova if we can. If we can. There's a big if after all. Uh Bayamon. Um The Buster Argon Buster million. was once Ugh. the pride of the Argon fleet and was instrumental in gaining the Argon um, victory in the Xenon conflict. A Nova would be two million. However, it's not during bad. the Boron campaign. It was superseded by the Argon Elite. Successfully docked. That ah uh, feels connection to mm. local trading network established. I feel like just saving up for a Nova, honestly. Ore is the most common mineral. Ore sold. You Only eighty-two thousand, but whatever. It is absolutely perfectly free money, so I am perfectly all right with that. This laser forge manufactured. Uh, 
How far away are you? Beta IRE Forge. Alpha. And Teladianium is over there. A Teladianium found. Uh, 34 versus... This laser forge manufactures... 34. Docking grand <sighs> So yeah, we'll make our way to that. Technically, silicon cells form more, so I should probably start ripping that out. The reason I went for the ore first was one to test it out, and two, I was just going from top to bottom, honestly. A Teladian sun oil refiner. But anyway, I'll be back in a second when we make ourselves quite a bit more money just from ripping these asteroids apart. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay, welcome back. We've not got all of it yet. <clears throat> Yeah, just cleaned it up a, di a bit. Not much. So, let us uh, go through the <laughs> I'm going to go on a little exploration trip. I probably should have actually, now that I think about it, brought the Discoverer. Also, if you want, uh, feel free to name some of these ships, because I honestly have no care for naming them. So if you want to name them, then feel free to drop some names in the comments, and I will get round to it. You know, just all I would say, so if anyone wants to name something, then feel free. Anyway, in the meantime, let us uh, go through the North Gate and we'll see what's basically here. I just need to open up some more trades because, honestly, I've pretty much stopped everything nearby. So I need to find more places to trade. And I thought, hey, go through the North Gate, probably the best. I'm trying to right now find places where I can sell the silicon. Gain. And hopefully, excellent, we have a crystal fab here. Crystal fabs. Unfortunately, crystal they fab. already have Alf autopilot off. Uh, more than enough power right now, or uh, silicon right now. So we're going to have to find somewhere else. So for now, deeper into the center of the sector. See if we can pick up anything. Hmm. But anyway, ah, uh, ba 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 ba. Once, fa once a favored retreat of the Boron philosophers and visionaries, this sector is now managed by the Taladian has become a preferred destination for fun with seekers, weed heads, uh, space hippies, and space hippies of every race. Uh, the Bliss Place in the center of the sector produces the narcotic spaceweed, a, med a medicinal drug of choice for... or no, meditative drug of choice for the dreamers, artists, and neo-philosophers that are drawing drawn here. Huh, okay. Interesting. So basically this is just Happy Haven. This sector is the 60s. Hmm. But alas, let us see what we can find. Hopefully somewhere to drop off all this silicon, because... I really do need a place to drop it. I mean, we have quite a profit in our hold if we can find a good place. Alas, it's the finding of said good place. There doesn't seem to be anything over there, but people keep flying over there. There must be something to the north. Unless that guy's gonna stop at that North Drop Factory. Nope, he keep he's keeping going. Teladi Harrier. Navigation command oh, not installed. That's fine. We'll just follow him the good old-fashioned way. Where are you going, mister? Were you just exploring too? Or is there an ulterior motive you're all traveling up here? No, just exploration it looks like. Okay, I can I can deal with that. Okay, so crystal fab, crystal fab how are you doing? Crystal fabs produce many crystals that are 
500, that's not to my preference. I would like it to be about 700. Ah, uh, but I would settle for 600. <laughs> Alas, though, right, let us get moving to the next sector and see if we can find anything there. I really do like the uh, descriptions for the sectors, though. I never looked at them as I was playing it the first time round. Because honestly, I just could not be arse reading. One, because of dyslexia, and two, because it was information I didn't really need to understand. I like learning about the systems, though. Hmm. Anyway, we'll make our way to this sector. Actually, what sector are we going to? Now think about it. Date, family, we. Oh! Split territory. They're not going to even let me talk, are they? Uh, are we an enemy? We are enemy. Will we get shot at once we get in here? Is what I'm worried about. I don't think so, but we'll have to wait and see. I mean, none of the other split I've come across have been Entering aggressive. System. Family. We. Okay. A Rasta refinery is a dark and foul. Nothing as of yet. Normally they would have shouted at us if they were getting upset. I think we might be okay. Originally a paranid hard labor camp hmm. designed to hold original Oops, that's not what I meant. I thought I could Oh, do I not have a trading computer? I thought I did. No, I must have a trading computer or I wouldn't see the prices of things. Hmm. Originally a paranid hard One minute, I'm curious. Docking denied. Yeah, I can't even dock here. Right, so we'll make our way out. Anyway, on the split Taladi border, this sector is the location of much of the limited trade between the split and other species. The two Taladi systems between Family Wee and the nearest Boron tr uh, system provide a buffer between the two feuding species. It is unusual. It is usual, however, to find the split destroyer deployed against the unlikely threat of a boron sneak attack. Okay, we're not being shot at. That's good, but someone has been shot at, which is interesting. Ooh, how does he look? Mamba. <gasps> that looks so cool. I forgot that the split ships look so cool. <laughs> What's the Jaguar look like then? Split Jaguar. Uh Jaguar. Jaguar doesn't look as nice. Oh well. Entering system. Teladi game. So, we don't have much in that direction, unfortunately. Crystal fabs produce. Well, it's maturing into the direction I want it to go, but alas. Still not quite there. Warning, cargo bay, Oops. cargo bay closed. Uh, navigation dock at. Seize well. Docking Not actually going to dock Autopilot there, just a quicker activity. way of travelling. But anyway, I will see you in a moment when we get there. Okay, welcome back. We're about to go through uh, Greater Profits. Or go to Greater Profit, I should say. Thought I might as well bring you in, have a look and see what Entering it looks like. System. Greater Profit. Hmm. Looks nice enough. Um, can we stop? Stop, stop. Autopilot I keep forgetting off. what the autopilot button is. I think it's different in later games. I don't think it's you. But anyway, that doesn't matter. Ooh. Crystal fabs produce many crystals that are used Close. in the manufacturing processes. 
closer than the last one anyway. I'll explore the systems a bit better later. For now I'm just going to bring you in and basically open up the systems with you. Anyway, Greater Profit, a relatively safe system ideal for a short trading run. A debate a debut in factory ownership and debut in factory ownership. The sun oil refineries in the system are more and more in the surrounding systems are reliant on the import of sunrise flowers, making this an ideal location for a solar power plant or a dream farm. Hmm. Interesting. Okay then. Split Kaiman. Yes, yeah, a split came in. Right. So I'll explore this a bit later. I'm not actually exploring it right now. I'm just quickly flying through them. Open up a bit more areas for me to try and trade within. Because right now I'm running short on areas to trade. At, to be honest. Gate. Space weed. Drift. Autopilot <laughs> activated. That sounds like a pirate place, doesn't it? Uh, chip plan. Chip plants produce microchips, Ooh. essential components in all computers. They're usually located near a computer plant with a steady oh, so stream of transport really loud. chips it's traveling really loud between the two locations. Huh. The chips are manufactured from uh, silicon wafers that are especially treated with various coatings to create a required conductivity. In some special circuits, Magellite is used to provide a su uh, special superconductive coating. Once complete, the chips are then sent into a computer plant for insulation into the computers. Hmm. It's nice to know. Entering system. Space weed. Drift. Autopilot off. Ah, uh, well, if this place doesn't have any hookers, I'll be surprised. Ah, da 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 da. Hmm, we have Dream Farm and a Talariarium right away. Anyway, uh, Space We Drift. This system is jealously guarded by the Talari as it contains a scarce organic and mineral resources. The seas of uh, Phobos 4 uh, produce kilometer high weight. Wow. And the best surfing in the universe, bar none. The system has a thriving tourist trade based mainly on the day trips of Borons to the planet's surface, many surf Merciful resorts. Or submarine? A submarine? Uh, I don't know. Anyway, I am going to leave there, so until next time, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed, where I'll make a bit more money and hopefully get an over. I don't know, we'll see. I'm being a bit too ambitious, I think, when I'm saying get an over. But alas, I will make a bit more money nonetheless.